We start with breaking news here at noon on this Monday. Tulsa County deputies are investigating after a man was found dead inside his car. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. I'm Shannon Rousseau. Investigators tell News on 6 is Sawyer Bussey. They know who the victim is, but they cannot release that person's name until the family is notified. She is live on the scene with the latest details for us. Sawyer, what do you know? Well, Shannon, we actually just got through talking to a man who says he's the cousin of the victim on scene. He says the victim's name is James. He went by JJ. They say they were just with him last night watching a football game. That He was acting normal. And then this morning, uh, they were called to this scene today. Uh, the scene is actually cleared up now. Investigators are gone. The investigation, this part of the investigation is finished. The tow truck has come and the medical examiner has come and left. I'm gonna move out of the way and show you. It's this driveway right over here. Um, um, there's a silver, or it's actually this blue house um, where this happened. Um, deputies tell us this isn't the house where the victim lives. His coworker lives here and he had been calling her last night. Deputies are not telling us any details about the nature of those calls. She woke up this morning and saw him in her driveway, but told deputies she was trying to take her baby to school. When she got back is when she noticed the man was dead in his car and called for help. There are obvious signs of trauma to the body, but we can't tell yet if he's been shot, stabbed, both. So the ME is going to do their determination and let us know what the cause of death is. Uh, he is a black male in his 40s. You know, as I said before, he is a friend of the woman that lives here. Now, deputies tell us the victim is a black man in his 40s and was friends with a woman who lives at this house. More details will be released as uh, probably later on today, as soon as all of the family members are notified. If you know anything about this, call the Tulsa County Sheriff's Office. Sawyer Bussey, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.